So this is a tour of Peter Power Pizza in Gilbert, Arizona. First we have a dino claw machine. There's a lot of cool toys there. We got, let's see, we got a ride over here. We got a uh, Harpoon Lagoon. It says get hooked, kind of funny. There's a Barney ride. I don't think I've seen this before. Here is uh, Trolls, it's like a tower of tickets. You uh, press the button to knock the arm to get the puck into the wind spot. I believe the uh, max is 100 here. That seems about right for a pizza parlor arcade. Here is a uh, ride. It uh, says uh, Wheels on the Bus, so I'm not sure if that's the name of it or if that's the name of the song. Here is Grand Piano Keys. Grand Piano Keys has the two sides and the bench. And then there is Fishbowl Frenzy. The uh, jackpot is uh, not uh, the same, it's uh, moving, it's kind of interesting. Here's Pink Panther for 100 tickets, but the uh, game is off. Here is Full uh, Tilt. Uh, let's see, is the jackpot in the front, in the middle, or is it in the uh, sides? Oh, it's in the middle, it's good. Here is Quick Drop, and I believe it maxed out at 250. And then there's Super Bikes 2. Two Super Bikes 2. And then there are two Cruising Blasts. And we have uh, Black and Wind for two points. And the max is 200. Terminator Salvation. Uh, spin and Win. Uh, goal Line Rush. This isn't one you see very often at a uh, uh, arcade, but they have it here. Pretty cool. And the max is 150 for the uh, Golden Football. Here's another somewhat rare one. Uh, big Dog Pounder. You just uh, press the uh, bone and the balls uh, go into the dog mouth. Here is Down the Clown. The uh, jackpot is 250. Right now the score to beat is 493. Fun game. Here is Beanbag Toss for 250. And there are a lot of beanbags, so it is definitely possible to get that bonus. So definitely a good one. And you actually get a fair amount of tickets even if you lose. So you get up to 20 tickets. That's really good for a pizza parlor arcade. Here is, uh, what's this, NBA Game Time. There's two of them. Uh, the score to beat is 75. And uh, you win 100 tickets if you uh, beat the high score. So there's what, five balls there and four balls there. So you definitely want to use the one that has more uh, more balls. Ooh, this is really cool. They have um, SpongeBob Order Up. I don't think I've ever seen this game work. So that's really cool. Here is Safari Ranger. I've only seen this at Peter Piper Pizza. The, it seems to be a pretty rare game. Um, I don't think I've ever played it, so I don't know what you have to do. I think you have to you know, capture some animals. Here is, what was it? A uh, pirate game, it's what? Uh, Dead Storm Pirates. Looks pretty cool, I guess. Here is uh, Crank It. It's kind of like Big Basketball, but not as good, in my opinion. This is Prize Explosion. It's a claw game with a bunch of bouncy balls. Let's see what else there is. Here is the SpongeBob Pineapple uh, Arcade. SpongeBob Point Pusher, whatever you want to call it. Not the SpongeBob lineup game, which is a different game. And there's a lot of cards here, it's pretty cool. You get um, three plays for every token or every tap. Um, so that's pretty good. Uh, that means you get like, you know, 15 plays for five taps. And every tap takes like 10 seconds. So overall, it's a little bit cheaper than um, many arcades, but you do have to wait a while. So that's kind of like the, the downside. You see there it says tap to play one point. Um, some, uh, some arcades have it set up that one point will require 10 seconds and two for 20. But some places it's just uh, 10 all around. And this one's called uh, Shootin' Mania. Pretty rare game, pretty cool. You have to uh, press these buttons to uh, knock down these uh, prizes. And the points uh, correspond to tickets, I believe it's, yeah. It's uh, 10 tickets, or 10 points rather, for one ticket. Here is uh, Monster Drop for the Monster Jackpot of 2,500 and the regular Jackpot of 200. Pretty cool. Um, so you uh, gotta get into that red um, slot right there with the ring for the regular jackpot and get it into the middle for uh, the mega jackpot. And it's kind of hard to get in there. It's pretty lucky. Or rather, it takes a lucky bounce. And last but not least, here is uh, Hungry Chickens. Um, I think you uh, press the button, uh, depending on what side you're on, uh, and uh, the chicken will lower and you'll eat the, uh, 
eat the ball, eat the chicken feed. Um, I've never played this, I've never seen it, but it looks pretty cool. And it looks like the uh, bowling stick is 20. Uh, this challenge 100, I'm not sure what that means, so seems kind of hard. And let's see, uh, I'm not sure if I got this ride. Probably did, but um, pretty cool. And then here are the prizes. So we got the uh, um, small prize here, we got some racers, some dinosaurs, um, frogs. Uh, some lighter pallets. It's pretty cheap. Um, some more thing good there. We got some uh, uh, what's it called uh, rubber turtles. Not rubber ducks, rubber turtles for 75. That's a pretty good deal. And then this section is the candy section. Uh, pretty cheap candy, cool stuff. Uh, yeah, um, it's pretty cool. And then here's some more toys. Pretty cheap, pretty cool. Um, and then we have the, uh, uh, let's see, on the left side, it's uh, 1500 to 2500. Uh, it's uh, some Playmobil, some G.I. Joe. We got uh, some plush, some trolls. And on the bottom, we have more Playmobil, some more trolls, and we got some, uh, it looks like a, a skip it, which is pretty cool. That's back from the, uh, back from the 90s. And over here is uh, 500 to 1,000. I think these are actually really good, uh, considering the cost. You got balls, you got some mystery Scooby Doo's, you got some uh, bags, some uh, plastic curtains. And up, uh, on the next shelf, we have a uh, block ball, we have some uh, pony thing, uh, some like a Pete the Cat, a spring. Uh, there's a bug catcher, bug catching kit, flying disc, and then over here, here's the big one. Um, there's a, a micro titans, gable wiggle. We got a cool uh, bear flesh. Um, we got uh, some Justice League stuff for 4,000. We have Super Monsters Popmatic Trouble, pretty cool. Um, looks like a remote control robot. Uh, some Transformers bot bots. Um, and then up top is the, you know, the big wins, I guess, of the big wins. There's a really big foam dart. There's a flamingo, I think. There's a SpongeBob SquarePants um, uh, air hockey game. And there's some um, Zuru Smashers Ice Rex. So overall, that's a lot of cool stuff. Um, I forgot to show the uh, kiosk though. Here's where you buy the card. Um, pretty cool. And then also there is a spot where you can pause the card. So you get one pause, uh, regardless of how big you are. Um, how many uh, minutes you have on your cards, how big your card is. And uh, this is Peter Piper Pizza in Gilbert, Arizona. It is um, owned by Chuck E. Cheese. So it's technically a Chuck E. Cheese of sorts, but it doesn't have the same name as Chuck E. Cheese. And they use uh, different cards. Um, but oh yeah, overall, this is a pretty cool uh, pizza parlor arcade. Um, there's a lot of cool games you don't see at a lot of pizza parlor arcades, and it's pretty cheap overall. So everyone watched, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you again next time.